So I guess while you're doing that, <clears throat> I'm gonna go over the uh, the basic rules of crossbow okay. just again, and then I'll go over what I'm gonna grade you on. Okay. So the number one, jump shotting 90% of the time. You know, it helps avoid uh, shooting your own team, as well as increases your overall headshot percentage by like 20 to 30%. Uh, reloading behind cover as much as possible. If cover isn't available, you know, reload behind concealment. You know, one blocks, one hides you. But if you do see an opportunity where you can get a kill and either option's not like available at the time, I'll call it like the, the archer equivalent of gambling. You can reload in the open, obviously. Uh, mm-hmm. Being near the melee most of the time, you know, provides like instant banner placement. Targets become larger because you're closer. It also baits melee into overextending, which I call drowning. Think of it as like a diver continuously to descend without realizing their surroundings or how much oxygen they have. It's the same okay. concept as a, a melee tunnel visioning an archer and then finding themselves surrounded almost instantly. Learn to yeah, jellyfish. The art of jellyfishing. Um, hunting bloodied or injured enemies to get the easy kill. Uh, number five, like um, anti-archer when needed. Headshots will always kill another archer with a crossbow. So if you see an opportunity, take it. And this one is like... It's hilarious that I have to even mention this because you're who you are. I make use of the one-headed axe special. Like almost always. That's what I open with, like, when people are having their backs turned to me and you don't need to reload. But Mm -hmm. telling you to do anything with a one-handed weapon is insane. So the grading (laughs) points, uh, I was going to do five full TO matches, but that's, like, way too long. So I think three full TO matches is is a bit easier. Well, I think I can get the gist out of three of them. And they'll all be from an S to D ranking. I'm sure you're not going to get a D in anything. Number one would be kill potential, more so with the crossbow than anything else. Uh, Anti-archering, objective effectiveness with banners, standing on point, that kind of thing. Covering concealment usage, the whole reloading um, cycle. And uh, comfortability with your secondary, which obviously is not going to be an issue for you either. Mm -hmm. So that's all I got. Okay, awesome. You can invite me whenever. Got you. I'm ready. Let's do this. Now, while you're on fire, if there's nothing else you can do, like dump an arrow and then reload, it gives you free fire arrow. Yeah, I know. That's what I tried to do. Teammates are getting in the way. Archers target their archers, Jesus, in the chat. Oh, is that Agatha or Mason? I have a hut off. Guys, guy on Agatha is saying that. (laughs) So I guess I guess I'm doing my job. Yeah. Nice. That was good. The duck. Oh my god, you fucking five head him. That was good. Oh yeah, you're only eighty three fifty and nine. No big deal. Just carrying the lobby oh, by three j Oh, it's quasi evil under me. Yeah, he's a really good player too. But I mean, that was a phenomenal showing. Thanks. 
I mean, <laughs> they keep coming to you. You know, why not? Right? How did that hit so late? I shot that and it, like I got the hit marker like a, a year later. Hmm. Classic shield jank. Right. Crap, my thing got blocked by the post. Luckily he didn't <laughs> have time to react. <laughs> This is the best spot. It's a pretty great spot for <laughs> sure. Like they have no idea. Like that night's just giving you freebies. Right. Nice. Not getting any takedowns from those hits, but that potential. It's like practicing and missing all the time. I'm like, damn, because they have like tiny little heads, tiny little frame. Like, oh, especially if they're reloading. Yes, yeah, that's that's an easy clap. Yeah. You know, if they're reloading, then of course. <laughs> that's oh, an cool. Easy target. You're playing on hardcore mode now. That guy's following you around, stabbing you. <laughs> hardcore mode. <laughs> Yeah, just whatever. Like... Yeah, I always try to cool. hide them if I can. Like, put them up against something or camouflage them a little and bit. Try and just put that there. <laughs> yeah, hey, that works. <laughs> Usually, it just, like, it protects it enough to where they don't even try. And with this it. pain train, I guess it, it honestly doesn't matter too much. archer it was an archer <laughs> that was a good shot oh, yeah. i went to line up the headshot because it was an archer i normally don't go for headshots yeah that's why i like the uh, jumping because like it just naturally because of where your your reticle placement happens to be it, you're gonna increase your percentage of course it's eh, it's pretty tough until you get to those last couple stages. Ooh! Damn! Get over here. Oh my god. Well, this one's actually kind of an archer's dream, because you know where the supply box is, and you can tell when people start making their way back there that they're probably injured. And if you stand, if you line yourself up with the cart, you're pretty much shooting a straight line. It's like a fish in a barrel almost. Nice. That was a good shot. Stop team killing me! Oh, it's kind of like a mix of team killing and not get free points to nope, take it I down. I have no ammo. You know what that means? <laughs> well, it means time for all of them to die. Over here, Archer. Good lord, man. Of course, they put all the defenses on the left. Okay, don't trap me in here, gentlemen.
Damn. He's evolving. Well, I'm sorry, but I, I guess this game's done. No, that's fine. I have. Was I have this the second match that. or the third match? That was the third. Okay. We are all good now to go. You can go ahead and make your verdict. Okay. Well, I'll start with the kill potential. Obviously, an S. Um. Okay. Dope. It would be stupid of me to be to give an A just because. You relied a lot on your secondary, but that being part of the class anyway, I mean, it'd just be silly to give it anything lower than an S. Like, your one-handed axe stuff is god tier, you know that. And you were hitting pretty incredible shots uh, more than a few times, so consistently. Dope. Uh, Anti-archering or counter-archering, S. I mean, there's like one or two hiccups that were due to positioning but every time most every time you went for the kill you got it um obj effectiveness the banners being on point s you're always near the objective or on it the banners were perfect um there's like a couple ones that maybe you could have hid them a little better so they didn't get destroyed but they they pumped out enough numbers to to be valid um cover and concealment S. Uh, there was maybe three times total in all those matches where you were um, consistently reloading like out of cover or concealment but you weren't under any immediate threat so I'll let it slide. Um, and lastly comfortability with secondary obviously in the highest S you could possibly get because you are who you are and you crushed it so I would say overall, wow, you're, you're an S tier level crossbow player for sure. Thank you. Yes, I sir. appreciate it. Not That's a problem. The validation that I needed. I can I can hear it in your voice. <laughs> <laughs> but you definitely didn't need me to validate that. Like you're you're an incredible player. So. Well, thank you. Yeah, I um, I guess if you ever wanted to see me play skirmisher. Oh my god! <laughs> with with throwing axes. 